A car theft captured on camera. You can see one car enter this parking lot just before daybreak, and as the sun starts to rise, not one, two cars leave. That stolen vehicle, a 1967 Mustang. Its owner now turned into the community to help find that car. Yeah, not just because it's a classic. So he bought and restored this with his grandfather in 2005. Now those 17 years of memories are gone. Our reporter Leslie Delisbor shows us how important it is for him to get that car back. Um, this is a car I always wanted to get. And uh, since I was a kid, I've been looking to get a 1967 Mustang. At 18 years old, Josh Grover's dreams came true. When I went to college, I was staying with my grandpa. I wanted to learn the skill of restoring and working on an old car. And uh, Grandpa and I, we spent uh, about five months looking for a 1967 Mustang, and we found one. Only to have those dreams crushed 17 years later. Wow, I, it took my breath away. It took my breath away just because I never imagined my car would get stolen. Happening here in this parking space on North Seneca Street and North 6th Street in Leavenworth. White uh, Malibu came down the street here and then uh, pulled in. My 1967 Mustang would be parked right here. It appears as though that uh, they stuck something over the window to unlock the door, got inside, and then they spent the next 25 to 27 minutes um, hot wiring my car. With the car gone, Josh's mind shifting gears on how to tell his grandfather. Um, so calling him to tell him that car was gone, um, he told me that he would, uh, he's got a big collection of cars and he's like, do you want another Mustang? And we, you can do it all over again. I won't be there to help you this time, but you can do it over again. I turned all those bolts. I, you know, swapped just about every part out you possibly could. Um, it's just disappointing to see it gone. Down the road, Josh now hopes someday his prized possession full of precious memories will make it back to him. My grandpa's definitely older, much older than he is when I was living with him in college. So he's, he's 84 years old. So if I were to find the car 20 years from now and it was rusted and just, you know, gone to trash, I would still want that car. And I would, I would restore that car back again because I want those memories back. In Leavenworth, Kansas, Leslie Dallas Bohr, KSHB 41 News.